and we'll take one more ride. Doors Hi open. guys, it's Drake from Escalator Travel Lights in this UK and in this video today I'm going to show you what happens when you basically put a form disc into an Xbox One S. Yes, and uh, basically you're basically obviously having your good experience on the Xbox One S which has the 4K graphics and stuff. So let's get started. So obviously you need to turn on the um, Xbox One S. Let's turn this on and then uh, got the controller up and running. Okay, so yeah, and right now we've got a disc in and it's a Blu ray disc, so we don't need to worry about the uh, normal Blu ray. We've got a Blu ray disc in there, actually. We have a uh, uh, Fast and Furious 6 in there. And we'll start with an Xbox One game. We're going to start with Lego City Undercover. Because that's the game. That's my stack of games. Because that's actually my last stack of games here. And, uh, show you it working. Just make sure to show you. Uh, but the game is in there. Uh, the uh, video's in there. Uh, so I just uh, yeah, so you can see the Xbox One S. It's got a new dashboard, as you can see. Um, and uh, there's the dashboard, and we've got a Blu-ray in there now. Uh, yeah, so we've got a Blu-ray disc open. Got Blu-ray in there. We've got Fast and Furious Six in there. Uh, basically, I'll show you. Wait for it to load. Give it a minute to do that. There we go. So Fast and Furious 6 is loading. There we go. So use first all. So, yeah. There you go. You can see that works. All right, so let's go to Xbox um, One game now to show you it working. So we have C in the cover. This game was made for the Xbox One, so we'll show you it working. And I have to keep hitting the eject button, I know, but it will go in straight away, but fortunately with this Xbox One as it used to. And here's it in the cover. Let's just uh, click on it. There you go, you can see the game works. So, yeah, obviously Xbox One games works on the Xbox One. So that's really uh, very good to hear from Microsoft. So, yeah, without further ado, um, got some couple of updates here. Alright, let's get next one. Alright, so, Xbox 360. Now, obviously, games are backwards compatible, not all of them. So, here's FIFA 07. This one doesn't work. So it's not backwards compatible. There you go. So actually the game's not playable. Microsoft has made this game backwards compatible. But now if I was to put in Midnight Club, which is a game that is backwards compatible. You will see it will work. Yeah, you need to insert the disc to make sure we've got rights to play this game. Okay. You alright? I'm just going to nip out and fill the power up and fuel. We'll be back in a minute. 
Okay, I, I was out. Get some um, fuel. In that for our car. So yeah, sorry about that, guys. Yeah, really. So it does. Ed Xbox One uh, and 360 games will work. Not all of them. So. Next, we have got. It's going to be my fingers, but we can get better in this room. It's going to be the lead. We've got Forza Horizon 5 next, will be Xbox One. Oh well, no, not Xbox One, Xbox Series X, which is obviously still made for um, Xbox One. And it should come up. I'm going to log in to my account. I think my account would have been better on this one. Because my account. Because I guess this is the guess it's going to have. Basically, uh, yeah, acquire desk. So, yeah, I'm just gonna sign in to my account. Just bear me for a second. There we go. Let's log in as my account here. And um, for this one, just whilst I'm loading up Horizon 5, because that's where my account would have been on. There we go. It's on Game Pass as well, but yeah, checking it works. This is a Game Pass game, so you basically you need to, uh, obviously, you can you get a disc version or just grab it, or grab it as a normal disc. Get a Game Pass and all grab it as a disc. It's Cloud Street, it's got Cloud Gaming on this one as well, Cloud Gaming. Um, don't need to uh, basically have a disc, you just put a disc somewhere, and you're just good to go. One does support HDR by the way. High dynamic range. It's got 4K HD. So yeah. Yeah, this one here is obviously a, it's a new update, isn't it? So basically the game is starting up with the um full screen, but yeah, you can see but the game works. Um so Let's just go to home. Okay. So, so that is that one. You need jet buttons for a trick on me. <laughs> but yeah, this game's on Game Pass. No disc. Okay, Star Wars Did I Survivor. This game was obviously only made for the Xbox Series X right there. But we'll see what happens when you play it on in one S. It'll probably be coming. As you saw on the Xbox One earlier like last time, you can see. But yeah, the game is incompatible. It will show up right now here. There you go. This game is compatible. Try choose something else or try and put a disc on your Xbox Series X. So obviously you can only play it on your Xbox Series X. All right, anyway, so yeah, we normally have got some PlayStation games. All right, so here we have Spawn 1 2. All right, so here's Spawn 1 2 for the Xbox, uh, no, for the original PlayStation. Okay, see what we've got here. Nope, it says restart, yeah, and try again. So basically, whenever you put in a PlayStation 1 game, Go come with this message. So we get out of here. So PS1 game will not work. Let's move on to come on. Let's move on to PlayStation 2 next. We've got 2006 uh, FIFA World Cup Germany for the PS2. And it goes. Um this game obviously came out in 2006 also. Nope. Same thing as what I had on a PS1. And this goes back in here. Yeah, so, let's go ahead and do PS3 next. FIFA 17. Let's see here. Nothing doing. Alright. So, Fine. I'll accept that. I actually have it on the Xbox One as well. 
and the um yeah so we've got ps4 game next fifa 22 let's see i actually have it on xbox one but i'm trying So moving on. Next we've got a PS5 game. FIFA 23. They're coming out with a new FC 24. That's coming out for both consoles. So I'm definitely going to get that for both consoles. It's going to come out for both PS4, Xbox One, uh, PS5 and C6 as well. It's going to be on two side consoles. So, nothing's going to happen. Let's just set it to scout. It's Ultra HD, isn't it? So, Xbox One can play 4K Ultra HDs. Definitely. Because this TV not only has HDR, but it also supports Ultra HD for the, um, for, like, That was quick. So, obviously it's going to be a Wii game, isn't it? So, Mario Kart 8. Oop. Obviously this game will probably only work on the Wii U. Succeed. We've got media stuff now. So here we have a Me Succeed. If I can open this, and um, so Me Succeed. All right, I'll be under Windows Media Player. And first time you order, you will be prompted to uh, download it. Obviously, in order to uh, play Blu-ray. Well, no, uh, to uh, play music CDs. So here I'm going to click on music CD. And there we go. And we'll just click on one of them, play it. There we go. Let's just come out of there before I get copied by claim. And we'll move on to a DVD, like a straight up DVD. Star Wars The Force Awakens. Man, I love Star Wars. I love Star Wars movies. And it should appear right now. There we go. Blu ray. Let's open it up. It should load. There we go. Just load it up. So, yeah, that works. I'm not going to get too deaf with this because Lucasfilm have made this, obviously. And um, we don't want to get copyright issues. So, moving on, we've got a 3D Blu ray. This is the one that the tax uh, 3D. And we know that. And that will be the last one because obviously we showed you the Blu-ray disc before I started this. This will be the last one for today. Okay, so open up a Blu-ray. Got 3D to tat. 
Okay. And it decides to go back to home on me for some stupid reason. So let's just go ahead and... Uh, went straight to home for some stupid reason. It needs to go to the... There we go. We've got 3D detached. Nope. Takes it back to home. Does it all me. This should have worked. takes it straight back to home but yeah it does work obviously blu-ray will definitely work obviously 3d blu-rays will definitely work anyway so yeah yeah so it's not so it's to get it crashed i don't know why it, it crashed but uh yeah we'll just put this back in and we'll end the video and that will do for the video if you liked it please like and subscribe my name is Drake, this is Escalator Travel Out of UK, and I'll catch you in the next one. Back down zero. Get there. It's all close button works, I like that.